fabulous suite we have here. This is fantastic. Um, I love the whole feel of the space. It's quite dark, it's a lot of down lighters, which are always quite difficult to work with, but we're going to put our own light in. Now, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a picture of Alice here, and she's just going to be slinking here like this. And I want to get some depth to the picture. I want to put moonlight in the back, and I want to get a nice warm glow from the front to make it look like the light's coming from perhaps one of these uh, bedside lamps or a, a down light or something like that. So we'll get some nice warm light in from here. So let's do that first of all. Let's come over to here. This lamp here, this is a Super Panel 30. Um, and at the moment it's in hue, saturation, intensity mode. Now we need to get it off that and put it into correlated color temperature mode. So I just whiz that through to there. Now we can then set our color temperature to where we want it to go. It goes from 10,000 Kelvin all the way down to 2,800. So we're going to park it at 2,800. We're going to set the camera at 3,200 Kelvin. What could possibly go wrong? Um, at, at the moment, we've got a green shift here of plus one. I don't need a green shift. In fact, you can go from plus one to minus one. I'll park it on zero um, because we're not having to sort of counteract the light that's coming through double glazing or balance this with some other fluorescent lights, etc. So we've got that controlled out. Anyway, this is the colour we need. Let's put it into situ. So something like that there. I think that's going to work quite well. I might bring it out a little bit, just to about there. That's nice. I just want to get it off the end of that painting there, or that, um, that picture there. Let's have a little look. I might have to take the power down a little bit, perhaps down to there. We'll see, of course, when Alice is in. So at the moment, we've now got ourselves a sort of believable warm light, okay? All I need to do now is get that moonlight in and then balance the two. Let's give it a go. So over here, this is a another Super Panel 30. So we're just pairing them up. So that one's in, in a correlated color temperature mode. This one's, we're gonna keep in hue, saturation and luminance mode. So what we need to do now is find moonlight. Now, I'm just going to use my eyes to do that. We've got to make sure there's not too much red in the mix. And every sensor is going to have a different feel to it. But I think about there. That's nice, isn't it? Lovely. Of course, moonlight is just reflected sunlight. And it doesn't have, in, in the real world, it doesn't really have that much of a cool look. It's just that because we have tungsten balanced interior lighting, it makes, you know, it, it gives us as cinematographers an opportunity and photographers to, to play with that and, and put that little shift in and I think that is looking great. Look at that, fantastic. So we've got that lovely sort of blue flood and it's just lighting that nicely. So great, that's in position. Let's win, let's have a little look at this. This feels right, there's probably too much light there. Let's drop that down. Just got to get a sense of the lighting just by feel and it's working with continuous light like this rather than working with flash. It's lovely because you can feel the light when it's right. So I think here that's going to go well. Um, let's bring the camera into position. That's the next step. Come up with the shot. Okay, so let's have a look at this. Let's switch this on. Oh, actually, that's not looking too bad straight away. The background looks great. I've got that ceiling fan in. We've got all sorts of things going on over there. This could be a murder mystery location or something like that. This looks nice, actually great. Um, but we do need a little bit more here, another half a stop. So I'll just crank this up. I reckon that's probably it, actually. So next thing to do now is get Alice in, see what happens. Alice, come on in. Why don't you to lean against here and looking back out that way. Lovely, thank you. Let's have a little look at this. This looks great. Instantly, straight away, I can tell that the colors are looking good. Everything's looking good. Look at that. I need to get that fan in the shot because uh, that's all part of the set that I like. Uh, I don't necessarily need the bath, so I'm going to lose the bath. Um, that's really nice. I like that. So let's bring both hands. Just fold your arms. Yeah, like that. There, that's good. Let's have a little shot. Yeah, shot there. Great. And let's do a couple more. Um, put your hands in your trouser pockets. That's, that's quite nice. They're sort of very baggy trousers. They look great. Yeah, that's gorgeous. I'm looking down to the floor to there. That's nice. A light, that's a light shot. Let's just do a couple of little closer shots like this here. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah. 
and to camera yeah they're great hold up there I just got a bigger wider shot to camera that's nice yeah brilliant thank you very much thank you so that's the sort of lighting you can do very simple two-point lighting um, with a bit of a moody blue background and a lovely warm rich foreground that's what I use for whether movie sets or just creating that little bit of drama dramatic images two lights easy Nice little sequence and just nice little sad look to camera. That's it, beautiful and happy fun. Yeah, love that. Great. Just mess your hair up. Just, yeah, yeah, that's lovely. And, um, and now uh, push up a bit Put it onto your elbows. That's lovely. That's nice. I like that. That's great. And then fun, fun. Yeah, that's great. Thank you. Yeah. Now just roll onto your side. Yeah, that's it. It's nice like that there. Yeah, love that. And just come this way a little bit and then bring the arm down to, onto the other arm like that there. That's quite nice there. See whether that works. Yeah, it's like a sort of bring this knee top leg forward, knee forward like that there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bring your face up. Oh, right, that's it. That's gorgeous. And just rest, your, just rest your head down and just have a little sleep. That's it. They're nice and quiet. Perfect. Lovely. Thank you very much, Thank Alice. You. Thank you. Excellent. So what I've done here, I've just used the same lighting system. So I've got correlated color temperature here set to 2800 Kelvin. I've brought the light right in and I've got my moonlight still from behind and I brought that in. So I've got two point lighting, the two lights facing each other, Alice in between, just shoot, 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 keep it high key, keep it exciting, beautiful boudoir two-point lighting at night, no other lights required. Perfect. Mm -hmm.